Do you want to hear footsteps better in Valorant or any other FPS game that you play, like in Warzone? Nah, joking. They have no footstep sounds. Anyway, this is the episode for you. Welcome to Lotus Lab. Today's episode is a little bit more technical, but there's a lot of people who are complaining about the fact that they don't hear footsteps clearly in Valorant. And I thought to myself, well, this might be actually a good episode to teach people how to alter their audio in the game so they are more let's say aware of what's happening in the game and it's very simple to do with the elgato eq that you can use with an elgato wave microphone or the elgato wave xlr audio interface so let's jump into the game we're already here in the practice range and what we're gonna do is gonna jump to the wavelength audio uh, software where we have already the game input inside of it right so all of the audio that goes into the game is in this input now we're going to click on this bot button on the bottom here and that is going to add audio effects when you download wavelength right now from the elgato website it's going to already have their vsts already pre-installed so when you click on the on the plus button there's already elgato eq in it so we add this and now this is being shown on the screen. We don't need this anymore. So we're going to just keep the El game Elgato EQ. Now, this is the wavelength of what you're going to hear in the game when something is happening. We're going to delete the presets that they have here. So we're going to add ours. But now we have to identify what, what kind of sounds, which wavelength we need to alter to make the footsteps more clear remember you can also use this elgato equalizer to your microphone or to anything else that is currently being you know played on your pc so we're gonna use the Euroclone to that generate footstep sounds okay we don't need this hello here we go and the footsteps up here in the range of like 300 like i mean maybe not 300 but like between 100 to 200 uh hertz right so this is this is the wavelength that we're gonna be aiming to alter when we're hearing footsteps so first we're gonna add a new band it's gonna be just a band pass and we're gonna boost this um wavelength with it right this is the um decibels that are alter altering uh, this wavelength now we're gonna also want to make it a little bit more focused so it doesn't affect the other wavelengths and i'm gonna do that with the scroll on the mouse so it's gonna be more like more precise right so we're gonna make it very very peaky i'm gonna put it around here right now and let's listen to the footsteps now without it and now with it's turned on It's more boxy, but also more easily noticeable, right? But it's becoming more boxy. We're going to add some decibels on it. We're going to move it a little bit to the left. And now we're going to add also another band. And it's going to be a high pass to remove some of its bassiness. It becomes very boxy. It kind of sounds like a Metallica's worst sounding album, but it is noticeable right so that's one of the things but we want to remove also the fizziness from it from it so we're going to add a low pass at the end and overall because we're boosting a little bit of decibels in the middle of it we want to remove a, li a little bit of the noise that goes in so now the footsteps are more easily be easily like you can just differentiate it from the sounds of the game because that just much more just let's say annoying right to hear rather than normal remember that all of those wavelengths and the way that you hear stuff is gonna be different for every single person because you will have different headphones you might have different audio drivers you might have everything on the pc actually will affect this as well so here first don't mind the numbers but what you hear is what is important this is like in general in audio engineering you don't really mind the numbers because if something sounds good it sounds good doesn't matter if you know the numbers are too high or too low 
it's just always done with a year test in the first place i hope this helped um if you have any results if you like it or not leave me a comment uh and that's about it it's very quick i hope you guys uh, like it and also by the way let's take a look at the phantom how it sounds ah let's turn it off also more noticeable all right let's go footsteps let's turn it on Huh? i might use this in the game myself hope you enjoyed this small quick tutorial see you around bye bye